This is Alexis Keta. She is the founder of My Legacy Challenge. Alexis is a young adult living in San Michuno. Alexis has the evil, hot, party animal squeamish and cool traits, and her lifetime aspiration is to find the one. There will be autonomous extreme violence and life tragedies, meaning chaos is bound to happen. Let's begin the chaotic journey that is Alexis Keta's life. First, we need a job. I was thinking of trying the new Simfluencer career from the high school years pack. $26 an hour isn't great, but with no skills, we can't be picky. Alexis worked on her charisma so she can get that much needed promotion. A new sim making food is always terrifying. Please don't burst into flames, girl. The night soon came and Alexis slept until she got a knock at the door. Oh no, not the f welcome wagon. Miss girl, are you good? Just started this save and the townies are already acting up. But I will steal the fruit cake. Thanks. Alexis went to the gym. Gotta stay snatched if we wanna catch us a daddy. Yes girl, give us nothing. While in the swimming pool, I spotted a potential daddy chilling outside. His name was Roy D. Dillon. He was tatted, muscular, and overall good looking. What more could a girl want? Money. The answer is we want money. Alexis wants to find the one, but the one got to have some bank. He seemed to like her. Or not. Whatever. She'll keep her options open. She then went to the park to look for collectibles to sell, only for one problem to occur. There were no f***ing collectibles. Literally no collectibles. I've never had this happen LMFIO. So instead, Alexis fished and looked for frogs. Oh my bad girl, I forgot you have the squeamish trait. Just breathe bitch, you're being dramatic. Again, Alexis wanted to keep her options open, so she decided to go on a blind date the same day. Who the f*** is that? Gross, he's old. But wait, old means close to unaliving. Unaliving means getting his money. Never mind, I see the vision. She learned his name was Christopher Volkov. Immediately, they didn't get along. She started yelling at him almost immediately after meeting him. He tried to lighten the mood by playfully teasing her, but she didn't like that and started yelling at him more. They kept arguing, and arguing, and arguing. She walked away from the conversation, and he still went up to her to argue with her again. Oh shit, what's happening? OMG this dude's a werewolf. OMG, not her getting dragged by a werewolf. Miss girl really thought it'd be a brilliant idea to fight with almost no fitness skills. Damn bitch, you got fucked up. Safe to say the daddy mission had failed. 